Hello, my friends. Good morning, everybody. We're uh, just doing a quick update here. I wanted to tell you uh, something that I was looking at earlier today. We're looking at a pretty crazy volcano this morning. Uh, it's quite loud. I, I will say that. I can't even turn it up halfway, so I'm going to turn this off. But that's not what I wanted to come here for today. Um, I am seeing a lot of people pushing this, okay? Uh, this one was done by Off Grid Desert Farming with Paul and Adrienne. And since it's got so many views, I wanted to cover it, okay? Um, they were reporting extremely... Or emergency alert for La Palma, extremely important. This video could save millions of lives, and here's why I think he's wrong. Uh, he's going by, if you go in through this, he's saying that these earthquakes are happening in a grid pattern. As you can see here, it looks like it's a grid, and I understand where he's coming from there. If he's if he just doesn't understand what's going on or doesn't understand the data as it comes. Uh, and this is, actually, I found this on Reddit as well, so they are pointing this out a lot. As you zoom in, you will find this grid pattern looking thing that's uh, going on. And here's why it's wrong, okay? When they do these earthquakes, they go by, as you can see here, they go by these 0 0.69, 0 0.79 in the, in the coordinates. The problem is it doesn't have the rest of the coordinates on the end of it, okay? So they only get to the uh, to the hundredth decimal place. Um, now, this is where it comes up. When they start showing up and they start stacking this information, it will only show on the point like the six, for example, this one right here, uh, 28.69, it will be zero, 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 zero to them, and 17.79, zero, zero, zero to them. And that's why it shows up here like this, okay? But if you actually, I got a link here, I will put this down in the descri description. I don't know if I can move this too much when I'm recording. <laughs> it's a really good program, but it's very bloated. Um, when you look at it, see, this is not in a grid fashion, okay? It's not a grid fashion. Right? Most of them are happening exactly where they're showing right here. See that? Okay. So it's it's understandable where that mistake was made by many people who haven't seen this data before, but the real truth of the matter is Oh goodness, come on and load for me. <laughs> where they're showing up is much more precise on other precise data. Okay, and you can see that I will because this is very bloated on my uh computer when I'm running OBS, I, I can't show too much of it there now. But uh that is what's going on there. When you go back to these numbers. They're only showing what shows on top. And it doesn't show the zeros here, but it comes up on the programs as if it had zeros on the end of it. Okay, so it'll show it. This will be, you know, one point or one hundredth decimal place, and then another one hundredth decimal place, you know, yada, so forth and so forth. And they're showing where most of them show up. Okay, it's just a way to compile data so that it's not so bloated. As you can tell, my poor computer was just hurt to try and do it so that's why it's showing up like that so as for why this guy needs to go in uh all caps here <laughs> and uh well i guess we can actually go through a little bit of this because the way that he presents it i don't know if it's very genuine i'm just going to point that out Friday night october the 22nd 2021 uh, it's a little bit after 11 o'clock here on uh arizona time uh, okay yada yada go ahead arizona <laughs> so what what we are I, I honestly I think that this guy might be in operation to make people look crazy who are looking in these things and are dis injecting or injecting this info um, I'm not saying that everybody that saw this and, and believe this are, are bringing out disinfo or anything like that. I totally see why the average person would see that and, and think that this is uh, not natural. But when you do look at this, once again, you do see it all. you see it all there. Um, but apparently this guy either couldn't figure that out or he's trying to deceive you. So let's go on. What are about to share with you folks uh, is so incredible that you're not gonna believe it unless you record this. So I'm gonna wait a few- So incredible that you're not gonna believe this. Uh, so you go ahead and record this. Like, it, to me, it comes off as someone who's trying to sell emotion in order to push disinfo, to be, to be quite honest with you. I, I mean, I don't know the guy, I don't know his heart, um, but what I do know is that he is either uh, unequipped to check his own facts or whatnot, and we all make mistakes or whatever, but this one is a really bad one that can be explained pretty easily. Actually, in fact, when you go to the, the, uh, the Reddit about this, the plebit, <laughs> People already say maybe they don't want to pile them on top of each other for sake of separating the data on the website. See, and they give lots of links there. Uh, it's pretty. It's pretty clear. It's pretty clear. Uh, this this person is either unable to uh, scrutinize his own opinions or whatnot, or he is trying to sell you disinfo. And you just hear it as it goes. A few minutes. Through. 
if you want to get your cell phone out and go to your picture you get your cell phone out so you call to action already before giving the uh, information so he's hyping it all up first right your setting your video setting i get it he's, he has a channel to run you know and i've done clickbait too you know and i've been wrong too on all those things too i get it uh, let's hope that he does issue a retraction or something like that or he does pull this video because it is basically this is this is the fear mongering that you know I, I don't really care about like people talking about other things but when you're so blatantly wrong uh, as a content creator you need to do at least make some effort to correct these things uh, screen uh, shot this video because um, this information folks is going to um uh, it's going to expose a lot of things going on. No, it doesn't though. It doesn't though. It just expose your own ignorance, honestly. Look at this, right? Um, and again, I'm not making fun of anybody who thought that this was legit or something like that, that they're coming in exactly in the same way. But all you have to do is look at the other tools and you see it, right? So I don't think it really exposes anything except for the fact that you probably should not be going to this guy for news. Just straight, plain and simple. That's, that's all I got to say. I, I don't know whether he's intentionally doing this or not. I won't go too deep into it, but uh, I think this covers uh, what I mean there. This is why you are seeing it like that. Do not worry. Do not worry. At least in this case, I don't see any any uh, indication that this could be controlled on a, you know some sort of uh, you know unnatural level. This this looks very natural to me. When you when you look back out and you see this, these are your deep earthquakes that are happening. These are the ones. This is where it's going into the um, the oceanic layer and it comes up through here, right? And it's trying to get out and it's trying to get up. We do see it happen as well, but mo for the most part, this chamber is very long and it's very tall and it's trying to negotiate its way through because the vent that brings it up to Cumbre Vieja is on a slant and that's what's going on there. So I hope that helps you guys. Um, I would not be trusting this guy and uh, normally I try not to call too many people out unless it's uh, they're trying to, um, what do you call it, uh, lie to the mainstream or whatever. But this guy's uh, kind of like on the back end here trying to inject this info, in my opinion. And uh, we need to call this kind of stuff out so that people don't get fooled. So thank you very much. I appreciate everybody that does research and everything like that. I understand why you would see this and think that it would be unnatural. And uh, hopefully this helps you on your way in your research. Okay, thank you very much. And we'll talk to you soon. I do have another video coming out that will cover more of the news. And we do have the live stream tonight at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, but uh, we will be talking before then anyways. And I will also have the Discord if you want to go in through uh, research. I think we did cover this as well there. And you can look into it more. So thank you very much, guys. And we'll see you in the next one.